To create this video series, we followed the overhaul of several engines. These overhauls were performed by our experienced mechanics. For each of these engines, a diagnosis was performed beforehand. A complete engine overhaul was necessary to make each of these Type 1 Volkswagen engines usable again. The first engine we used was this AB1300. It came from a Volkswagen Beetle that had been standing for years in a damp room. Moisture had accumulated in the cylinders and in the crankcase. Although this engine looked fresh on the outside because of the layer of zinc paint, the rotating part of this engine had never been overhauled. Here you can see that this engine had no regular maintenance either. The gunk on the bottom of the crankcase is from years of neglect. But we are going to make up for that by completely overhauling this AB1300 engine. This AS1600 comes from a 1303 convertible. The engine had a lot of imbalance, something that could only be remedied by a complete engine overhaul and by balancing the crankshaft with flywheel. But for that the engine had to be completely dismantled. The third engine is an AJ1600 and comes from a 1303 injection. But in itself it doesn't make much difference to the overhaul of the rotating part, whether it is an injection engine or an engine with carburetor. This engine had completely lost its power, the compression was no longer adequate, so a complete overhaul of the rotating part was the only solution. The fourth engine was this Type 1 1200 engine, with engine code D. This engine was not only in need of a thorough cleaning, it also had a stuck intake valve. You can see here the intake valve of cylinder 2 staying open, which is the second valve, starting from the left. Here you see the eight pushrods of this 1200 engine. The second pushrod from the right is bent by the jammed valve of cylinder 2. The engine was, except for the jammed valve, still in good condition. We got this engine back running after measuring and cleaning all the parts for a limited budget. Hopefully, this video series will help you rebuild your VW engine to your liking. In the following video, we will show how an engine mount, even for an enthusiast, can be useful during the overhaul of the rotating part of the engine. That's it for this video about the VW engines we used for this series. More information about all the parts and tools used in this video series can be found as comments below each video on our YouTube channel. Keep a close eye on our newsletter for new videos and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you soon.